Why, hello everyone, welcome back to Kingdom Hearts and Story Mode. I've been busy. Which is to say, my phone's been busy while I've been doing other things. Such is the way with idle games. Let me catch you up. It's been like a few weeks since I had time to sit down and record some more of this. And in that time, I have left my phone going overnight a few times even. Just uh, kind of nonstop doing this. Without fail, just for hours. And as a result, I have managed to get this little crew leveled up a good ways with much better cards. L let me give you a quick tour of some of the improvements I've been making. Uh, also because I understand a few of the systems slightly better. And uh, then as soon as I'm done with that, we'll just gun it and get back to the story quests and such. So here are where my stats are sitting out now. Level 22, much, much better cards in the works. Some decent accessories. Well, like nothing phenomenal, but decent accessories. This should carry us a good ways. Certainly far enough to get access to some much better grinding areas. <laughs> because at this point, level gains are very slow. But it's worked out. I'm very excited to see how fast we can move. So some some of the leveling up we've been doing has just been leveling up Xehanort himself, and we're not too far away, actually, from being able to uh, get the next level. Not that we need it. The other improvements, as you can see over here on kind of the upper right, are all the different cards that I have. You'll notice none of those cards, at least in that top half anyway, are just blank, simple, red, blue, or green cards anymore. Now they are all character cards. They've all got special abilities that they do and effects that they can trigger, elements that they uh, set off here. I can like select this one. This particular card does a tornado attack, a wind element attack with some pretty good power to it. What's more, like by default, some of these cards I've got here are very strong. Some of the stronger cards you can get in the game. This just, when you use this in a combination, fires off Extreme Arcana, which is a very potent light element, oh, just non-element non physical attack. A very potent attack on its own. You'll also notice down there, though, it says plus four. What that means is that in the shop, I have gone and found wherever that card is, and I have not just purchased it one time, I have purchased it four times. And every time you purchase that card again, that one card becomes stronger. So some of those cards that I've got in this deck here are not just stronger cards, but considerably leveled up stronger cards. Some of the cheaper ones I've already got to max, like uh, Ariel here. Not nearly as strong <laughs> as just the level four, that other Kingdom Hearts Sora thing, but still pretty good. I don't really know enough about all of these systems. Like you can dive in deep trying to fully understand and like deck build and build out something that's gonna make you really, really extremely strong and optimized. I just kind of went for the noobs method of where are all the strongest cards? Give me those. And I just threw them all into one deck. Normally in deck building, that's probably bad. Here, I think it's gonna work for us, especially given we are still in chapter one, fighting relatively easy things. At this point, the only thing stopping us getting to more story quests is me talking, but also just the time it takes to kill the enemies in each side one of these quests, because losing to them is not really gonna be a concern. So let's get back to it. What's more, let's actually swap back in Hermod here. Since we started this particular chapter with Hermod, it actually kind of feels good to continue with Hermod, I think. I bet I'm saying these names wrong. Ain't that always the way it goes? Anyway, I'm gonna keep on doing quests here. Tearing through enemies in one hit every time, most likely. Hey, maybe not always. But still tearing through them nonetheless. Ah, <laughs> uh, remember when we couldn't get through that. Hey, story quest. See? See what? I told you there were stronger Heartless around. What? You call that strong? It did kill us last time. Yeah, I do. But we handled them just fine. We did, but the missing wielders were all on their own. What would you do? If what? If you were alone and came across those monsters, fight. 
run. Exactly. Some would run, and some would fight. So even if they were alone when they encountered some of the, those Heartless, I doubt that these monsters are the reason why they all disappeared. Good point. But what if there are even stronger monsters out there? Ones you can't run from. Come on, seriously? You never know. Then I'd run faster than I ever have before. Of course you would. Another scene. Delightful. From what I can tell, I've looked up now kind of a, uh, not even really a walkthrough, just a list of the different quests there are in the game, just to kind of see where the cutscenes are placed. It seems that a lot of the time they're going to be spaced out like every four or five or six uh, quests here. So I'm going to be cutting pretty much all of that out because it's, it's just going to look like this. And I'm just leaving it on auto because it's way faster and honestly more effective than I would be. <laughs> And at this point, the faster I can burn through quests like this, the faster I can get us to more story. So y'all just sit tight while I burn through a bunch of these and get us to another story, Cena. Back in a bit. Hey, nice. I've unlocked a new rank of world battle, which will be much better for grinding in. That is fantastic news. So in theory, Hey, nice. I wonder how I fare in a two-star random fight. Yeah, still pretty good. <laughs> well, I'm not going to keep that going because I believe we've got a scene coming up. Get me out of here. You're back already? We just got here. Bet you got scared and ran. That's your MO. Huh? I'm glad everyone's okay. We ran into Heartless. So did we. But no sign of any actual people. Same here. Were the Heartless strong? Yeah. I hate to say it, but I'm not sure even upperclassmen could have taken them on alone. What now? Should we report our findings to the Master? No way. Huh? I agree. Let's not. So what do we do? This mission's pretty dangerous, you know. We're Keyblade wielders, right? We see a Heartless, we take it down. We can't just run when things get rough. The Master taught us all about the Heartless and how much of a threat they pose. The students who went missing knew what they might face and undoubtedly prepared for it. So what about us? Can't we do the same? Don't we have the same determination and drive? We do, and you're right. But if any of you feel like you're in real danger, run. Don't turn around, don't wait for the others. Run like the wind. Ericus. Let's try to find a solid lead this time. Should we change groups? Hey, why don't we? I'll start doing that from now on when they prompt it. And since, or we only got you in for like a tiny bit? Here, your turn. All right, round two. Just so I know, you weren't joking about running from danger, right? Come on, Vor. Running away is what Ericus does best. Be safe. We'll meet back here soon. I love all their armor. Keyblade armor's great. Anyway, fighting. 
numerous fights later. Part of what's making me much <laughs> stronger now is not just being higher level, it's not just having stronger attacks, it's that some of our cards also have curing abilities on them. So, like, whenever Tinkerbell or, I want to say, Ariel, Merlin, uh, maybe one of the Kyrie ones, maybe not. Like, anytime one of those combinations get used, I also get a cure as well. So any of the chip damage enemies are able to do to me at this point very quickly gets healed back up, even just in fighting, which is in part why I'm able to leave my phone going just overnight now, <laughs> doing mission after mission after mission and never dying. Oh. Time has passed. I wasn't fighting that long. You're leaving? Yeah. We had some good times, huh? Yeah. You don't have to leave. What happened wasn't your fault. I just want to see more of what's out there before the Mark of Mastery exam. That's not for a while. Besides, you've already seen what's out there. Not everything. What are you looking for? Fine, but you better come back. We've got a score to settle. I'm at 117 wins, 312 losses, and 8 draws. You mean 107 wins, 323 losses, and 7 draws. Whatever. Close enough. Do you seriously mean that? Knew I'd get you to turn around. See you soon, buddy. See you. And thus ends the first episode. The first of eight, I believe, and I don't know how long all of them are. They may get longer than this, some of them maybe are shorter. Couldn't tell you. Let's find out together, I guess. I never really thought about who I was. Not until I began to wonder who others were. Day after day, I spent my time with the same classmates in the same classroom. The days are peaceful and a little boring, but they're also familiar and comfortable. Even so, my new life is just like the old. A different world, but with the same days playing out over and over again. I left the island behind to come here, and yet... Maybe it's not about the place. Maybe it's about me. And how I engage with others. How we influence one another, and the world around us. Maybe that's what shapes our hearts, and who we are, and who we will become. All kinds of things can influence the growth of a heart. Change can come from anywhere, from the smallest, simplest thing. From light or from darkness. Episode 2, The Presence of Darkness.
They should be here by now. What? You're late all the time. Fashionably late. Says you. Hey, there's an art to my... Shh, we're being watched. It's about time they showed up. Ah! What is it? What's wrong? <laughs> Fair reaction. Twas Brillig and the Slithy Toves. Where did... Who are you? A Cheshire Cat, if you please. Or if you don't. A cat? Man, you scared me. Hmm. There's no point waiting around for your friends to arrive. How did you know we're waiting for our friends? Hmm. I'll never tell. Can you help us? Do you know where they are? Why, they're under lock. And of course, key, too. What? Where? Exactly. What or where? Hey, wait! So, what's the plan? Well, we don't have much to go off of. But we have to do something. Start looking for... Gah! Or just wait. The answer will be here rather soon. Is he really gone this time? What did he mean, anyway? Beats me. Ah, that might be our answer. What now? More intruders? It's not good to cause a ruckus in Her Majesty's Kingdom, you know. We're just looking for our friends. Not that that would matter. We'd best seize them. Hey, li listen to me. Hurry! The trial's about to begin. But we spotted some suspicious... No time for that. If you're late, you'll lose your heads. So, that's it? I guess we're off the hook. For now. But I'm not so sure about the others. What do you mean? More intruders, he said. Which means he must have run into people who looked like us before. That's it! The cat said our friends were under lock and key. And those soldiers were talking about a trial. That's gotta be where they are. Wait, a trial? For what? I don't know. Seems like this world has its own weird set of rules. At least now we know where to go. Then what are we waiting for? Heck if I know. Let me fight a bunch of stuff. Alright, I think we've got to the next scene here. The enemies are starting to put up a little bit more of a fight, but we'll see how much further we can get. Your Majesty, loyal subjects, the, uh, the, the trial has begun. How do we keep getting into this situation? The prisoners at the bar are charged with trespassing and willfully disturbing Her Majesty's peace. Wait, I'll own up to trespassing, but that's it. If anything, we were fighting the monsters to try and keep the peace. Oh... So you confess to a far more serious crime. Uh, you mean fighting monsters? But that's the only way... Always here are my ways. Everything you see obeys my rules and follows my ways. Everything? Like the people, this place, and even the monsters? Of course! But that's crazy!
This isn't going well. Trial-wise. I've seen enough. Wait. What exactly are you going to do? Isn't it obvious? I'm going to save them. By attacking these people? Remember, we have to respect this world's order. But what else can we do? Well, we shouldn't waste any more time standing around here. What are you smiling about? Let's go. Yeah, yeah. It's time for your sentence. And that sentence is... Guilty! Objection! Guys! That verdict is unfair and you know it. Who are you? And how dare you challenge me? They're guilty because I say so! They should be judged by a jury of their peers, and not by one single person. What right do you have to decide their fate? Because I am the queen! And... I am always in charge. You decide everything for everyone? Come on, there has to be a better way. What did they do that was so bad, huh? Can't you show some mercy? Or are you just a bully who rules with fear? The fear? Nonsense, my subjects adore me. Don't you subjects? Hmm, it seems unanimous. See? All power here is my power. Now, enough of this insolence. Off with their heads! They're gonna lose their heads? They're going to lose their heads! They're going to lose their heads! Seems like this is where we would start breaking into song. In normal Disney fashion. What now? Got a plan? That was the plan. We'll just have to wing it now. Great. That's what I do best. What? Um. Seize them! This is a pretty good pyramid they've assembled. Oh my. Whoa. Can I use my Keyblade now? You don't have to ask. The prisoners have been found guilty, so the, uh, the trial is over. Order! I said order! You will all pay for this! Cards. What was the plan? They don't stand a chance. Froggy! Ah, dang. This won't be easy. Ready when you are. Well, we'll see how easy it is. Probably not super easy, given it's level 40. I think if we're gonna get roadblocked, this is gonna be the place. But the health bar is going down pretty fast, so... We might be all right. Yeah, yeah, I actually do feel like we might be all right now. Yep. Beautiful. The story continues, I guess. I'm glad you're okay. Whatever. It wasn't too bad. I just... Never thought we'd have to deal with something like that. I guess. I mean, it was tough. But we weren't in any real danger. I'm not talking about the Heartless. You're not. But aren't they the enemy? Yeah, that's what we learned in class. Herman's right. It's not that simple. 
What are you guys talking about? A threat stronger than any heartless. The darkness in people's hearts. That's what drives the Queen of Hearts to rule with fear. But if that's the way of this world, then maybe it's not our place to say if it's right or wrong. We can't just go around challenging what we think is bad. So that's why you didn't put up a fight. We didn't have a choice. Hey, guys. Do you think the upperclassmen were caught in a similar situation? If they were, and they realized their hands were tied, maybe they got captured too. Or worse. What do you think? Xehanort? Sorry, what were you talking about? The missing wielders. We assumed the Heartless were responsible. But instead, it might be someone touched by darkness. Darkness can hide anywhere. Even inside someone. Darkness can hide anywhere, even inside someone. Huh? How did you... Me? I... Darkness can hide anywhere. Right. Look at the queen. She believes people respect her power, even though it's obvious they live in fear. That's the kind of delusion that might force our hand down the line. Even so, I still believe in the light in people's hearts. Me too. For now, let's keep searching for the upperclassmen. Yeah, we should focus on our mission. Hope we don't get sidetracked again. You're gonna jinx it. Hey, you okay? I'm fine. Come on, there has to be a better way. What did they do that was so bad, huh? Can't you show some mercy? Or are you just a bully who rules with fear? Fear? Nonsense! My subjects adore me! Don't you, subjects! I wonder, could darkness burrow so deep into someone's heart that they don't even know it's there? That's a scary thought. Could you turn your keyblade on a being that has no idea what they've become? I... don't know. One day we might have to decide. What are you two whispering about? Oh, just whether or not we should stick around here. There's a chance the others were put on trial just like us. I think we should try to find out more before we leave. Even though we might run into trouble again? Hey, why don't we split up? A few of us can stay behind while the rest go on to the next world. We'll stay. Just the two of you? Yeah, better to keep a low profile. Uh, something wrong? You tell me. And maybe I'll keep you company till you do. Well, what do you say? That sounds great. Join the crew. Yay! I promise you won't regret it. We'll see about that. See you guys later. Be safe. Eh, nice. All right, well, onward and upward through the quest line. Let's see how much further I can push this. And here's going to be the end of quest number 33. Still pushing on through. Ooh. Another skip ahead.
Interesting seeing them hop back and forth on the timeline like this. Your Majesty, the uh, the trial has begun. The prisoner at the bar is charged with trespassing and willfully disturbing Her Majesty's peace. How dare you trespass in my kingdom? Who are you? You don't remember me? I knew it. Hmm. And there's the end of episode two. Yeah, it is interesting how they're jumping back and forth from past Xehanort with his desire to leave his old isle, just kind of the desires that set him on this path. Current day, which is where most of the events are actually happening, and then distant future where we are seeing where he ends up. That's kind of an interesting way to tell the story. And even though there's not a lot of story scenes in this, compared to the amount of fights that the game has to go through, uh, it is an interesting way to go about it. I'm, I'm enjoying seeing how they're uh, doing this little narrative thing here. Well, that's two episodes down, um, both in-game and in playthrough, I guess. Whatever. I'm going to grind some more, just to make sure we don't get slowed down any further. And I will see you guys next time for some more Kingdom Hearts Dark Road. Do take care until then, and goodbye! Goodbye!